Hey y'all, it's Tweet Glow. I'm here for my third review for Jocelyn's Cabaret Miami. So last time we left off, they were at the dinner. So at this dinner, Lucky Hustler started telling her story, which I'm glad she started telling her story because I'm ready to hear all the ladies' stories to see how they got to where they're at now. So Jay talked about her not really being homeless because they kept coming at her about being homeless, saying she wasn't she, she, she wasn't handling her own, basically. So she told her story. She's not homeless. She's in between homes. She had a situation happen back at home where she's from. Um, it really pissed me off that Daisy was over there fake crying. Like, girl, please, please stop. We know it's an act. We know it's an act, Daisy. Stop. Chastity, she talk a lot of shit. She, 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 she a small package that talk a lot of shit. That's my daughter. Um, so the dinner, it was dragging on. Um, so we basically got to hear Lucky story. And then next, next we got Jocelyn pulling up to um, Jay, Jay spot. She left the dinner, by the way. If you did, if you don't remember that, she left the dinner because she didn't have time to be fussing with these girls. She got to make money. She out here making real money, and it's interesting that they put this on TV. I guess it's not TV, but it's an app. It's interesting that they put this type of thing on the app because it's not something that you you see the you, you don't see the realness of it on TV usually. It's usually sugar-coated and, and presented in a way that's that's glamorous. You know, like these days, being, being a, a stripper in, in the sex industry on TV now is glamorized. They don't actually show the realness of, of the thing, all the things that happen to these girls. Everybody doesn't have a Cardi B story. Everybody doesn't have a Don P story. Everybody doesn't have that stripper turned rapper famous story. So a lot of these girls out here doing this are in the streets. You know, they don't have a choice or they're trying to get out the game or this is all they know. So Jay left the dinner and she went to go get her tricks because she had to make the money. And I like Jay. Um, I like her so far. I mean, she keep it, she keep it, she keep it real. And I can't be mad at anybody that keep it real. Um, so it was interesting to see that Jocelyn had actually pulled up. You know, she did kind of blow up her spot, but I'm glad that we got to hear her story as well. I want to hear more details about exactly, you know, her upbringing and everything. But um, my condolences to her. Her mother died. She said her mother died in her arms. I can't imagine. I've lost a parent, so I have a certain connection with people that are are young that have lost a parent because it's a big deal. So I look at her differently now because people that have gone through traumatic experiences uh they they tend to i don't want to say be stronger but yeah they tend to be stronger they, t they tend to have to hold it together a lot more than somebody who had say a perfect life or, or a parent that didn't pass away they got their, both their parents so i want to hear more about her story um so i guess we're going to see about that during the season um so i like the moment that her and jocelyn had crying and you know Whatever, whatever, having that sentimental moment. So I think that was that was pretty dope. Uh, this episode again reminded me of the Black China type of scenes, you know, kind of dragging on for a whole forty minutes, like two y'all in two different places for forty three minutes. Like I want to see a little bit more. I know this is not love in hip hop. I get that it's more like independent. So I'm guessing that there aren't scripts and things like that. It's actually raw. So it's going to be moments where it's like, you know, whatever, you know, boring or, you know, they don't have, they don't have a script to follow. So just, I don't know. I don't, I, um, it's just, it's just, it's, it's just real. Sometimes there's not always something to say and the way they cut it, you know, I guess they, they cut it in a way for it to, to drag for the whole episode. But I wish that they they did more takes in, in different scenes and stuff like that. That would be nice if they started doing that, Zeus. But overall, um, this was episode three. Please like, share, comment. Let me know what you think. Um, chime in. Let me know what I missed. Like, 
Tell me what you think of the girls. But again, like, share, comment, speak with tweet, follow me, holla at me. Peace.